One of the first orders of business involves Rhode Island's own governor as the Biden administration seeks to have its cabinet nominees swiftly confirmed. But with the issue of impeachment still looming over the Senate, the timeline is still murky. On day one of his presidency, Hello, team. Joe Biden virtually swearing in his appointees as the new administration gets to work. We work for the people. I work for the people. Among his top priorities, a $1.9 trillion COVID relief package that would include $1,400 stimulus checks for most Americans. But the appetite to pass yet another massive bill might not be there among Republicans, a critical factor even though Democrats now control Congress. The Senate, as of Wednesday, now split 50-50. You still need 60 votes to get through uh, substantive legislation. Senator Jack Reed spoke with 12 News Politics Editor Ted Nisi in the hours after Biden swearing in. The Senate's next order of business, cabinet confirmation hearings, including Governor Gina Raimondo's on Tuesday. It is a, a presumption that a new president, in order to begin the administration, you know, there's certain deference to getting these confirmations done. One of the complicating factors is the pending impeachment. If that begins, then uh, our rules basically restrict us to impeachment activities alone. It's unclear when that impeachment trial will get underway. In the, In the new administration's first press briefing on Wednesday, Press Secretary Jen Psaki said the new president is less focused on impeachment and more focused on his priorities. And remains committed to his goal of getting 100 million shots in the arms of Americans in the first 100 days. And as you saw earlier, the president signed multiple executive orders today, including one that mandates mask wearing on all federal property and another to rejoin the Paris Climate Accord. We also learned today his first call with a foreign leader will happen on Friday when he plans to call the Canadian prime minister. Live in studio, I'm Kim Kalunian, 12 News.